welcome this is the energy vibration reading for sun moon and rising capricorns i am laughing because it is so funny um the devil is here as you can see it the devil is in disguise that's what i said about the reading for the month of may now this is the first week of may 2017 and the week begins from the first of may until the 7th of may but what is so fantastic about this week is that the energy vibration of this week is the is the energy of the lovers and the energy of the lovers is a wonderful wonderful energy because it is working on um, deep rooted emotional situation in your life deep rooted emotional situation in your life and this sort of a situation and this sort of energy this deep rooted situation that is happening in your life is something that is going to be releasing a lot of things you're going to be pulling out moving out a lot of things in your life and understanding how far it is and where you have been so my smile on my face is that the focus that I ask if the devil is here and if you look behind here the wheel of fortune is here but yet still your focus is the energy of the tower so what I am personally getting from this is that this week and you're going to see why you're going to see why I tell you my angels and guys have this weird way of showing um, you know the readings and things that's why I start doing the readings because a lot of people wanted to see my face and want to see the interaction which I think was good even though I was afraid of the camera for the first couple of readings I would think but now it's getting much better and I'm glad I'm doing this on camera because and I'm putting I somehow I start putting the deck of the card here and this tower is your focus and see the high of Oris in the tower it as if God is looking down and what has happened to you Capricorns and he's stepping in now he is stepping in now because you know I need to really give the three degree of all signs all the stuff that is happening you Capricorns are the strongest earth sign people if you look the Capricorns the, the, the wisest I should say but not the strongest because the Taurus are the bull so they are the strongest and the Virgos you know but you are the wisest because what is happening is that the wisdom and the wisest of God because most Capricorns they can see things and know things before it happens even you know they are people who you know the spirit when they meet people they always listen to their intuition now whatever is happening it is the end of something that God decided in this week that he's going to or God or source creator whoever you want to see it the Sun decide that he's gonna step in this he is going to put a hand in this he's going to remove this he's going to walk through whatever is happening because he has seen that something that some people have been oppressed by other people and he's putting his hand in and this is the tower because if you notice the focus would have been the devil and he says no and he's letting you know it's a the wheel of fortune is turning but it was a cause as a is a situation from lifetime and lifetime before from lifetime and lifetime before so this reading is going to be a little bit longer than the other one it's not because I'm a Capricorn but this is something that has come up that I have to express so remember it's the week of the lovers your focus is going to be the tower the energy of the tower saying cleansing whatever has been happening to you Capricorn a cleansing is going to come in and the high of Oris is there the tower is going to break down whatever that has been happening to you Capricorns because let's look at your week your week is consist of the Sun energy the world beside the Sun 
and the star beside the world okay you Capricorns I am just so loving this for you because what is happening you have judgment you have the three of Pentacles you have the Sun but yet still you have the world you have the the most beautiful beautiful you know the arcanas are here they are bringing out something they are healing something you have the key the, the king of Pentacles and um, the, the Aerophant. Now, as you understand, we're vibrating in the energy vibration of the week of uh, the lovers. You're vibrating in the energy vibration with the week of the lovers. And all these things are happening and a cleansing, a huge cleansing. There's something that has been happening in some of you um, Capricorn's life that the universe decided, no, we're taking, we're taking and we're taking this over. We're taking an end at this, and the universe has stepped in. And by God, the universe has stepped in. On Monday, we have judgment. Monday, we have judgment. The eons, we have judgment on Monday. Whatever has been happening, there is judgment coming out on Monday. The trumpet of the angels and the God and the, and, and, and the rolling of everything is coming out on Monday on Tuesday we have the three of Pentacles on Tuesday we have the three of Pentacles the energy of the three of Pentacles is people working together trying to make and, and, and build something in their lives so a lot of people are working together and trying to build something in their lives so on Wednesday the Sun comes out on Wednesday thanks be to God and this is what I'm saying to people whatever situation you have Call upon the sun, call upon the source of everything and ask them for divine intervention. Ask them for divine intervention because they always, we need to ask them so that divine intervention, when a divine intervention is going to come in and do not ask for divine intervention because you want something to go bad for somebody else. No, because it will happen to you. Okay. When you ask for divine intervention, say source of all things please look at my heart you see what is happening here I'm asking for divine intervention the Sun comes out on Wednesday on Thursday the world is here congratulations whatever is happening life is about to move out so whatever that was blocking you again I'm giving you one day at a time Thursday the world comes out on Friday we have the energy vibration of the star thanks be to the source of all things the energy vibration of the star is that all your wishes and dreams are coming true on Friday believe you me all your wishes and dreams are coming out on Friday so we need to understand where we are what we're doing how we are dealing with certain aspects because on Friday your wishes and dreams are coming out. As we look at Saturday, we have the Prince of Pentacles. The energy vibration of the Prince of Pentacles is here. So whatsoever is happening, you're connecting with this energy vibration with the Prince of Pentacles on Saturday. And this is going to elevate you and bring you to a space which is far further and higher than where you are you are going to move mountains on Saturday whatever financial situation you have it's going to change okay on Sunday you have the energy vibration of the air event and this is an organization so whatsoever is happening you being are going to this organization there is a powerful charge of energy that is going to come out and this is going to heal whatever has been happened so it's going to be a week of cleansing a week of powerful cleansing that is going to happen I I, I, I have done you know and the strangest thing is that your reading is just so beautiful um here we go on Monday 
Monday, we have judgment. Tuesday, we have the Three of Pentacles on Tuesday. Wednesday, we have the Sun. Wednesday, we have the Sun beside the Three of Pentacles. Wednesday, we have the Sun beside the Three of Pentacles. Thursday, we have the world beside the sun. We have the world beside the sun, okay? The world beside the sun. I'm trying to fit these up so that you can see them. The world beside the sun. And then on Friday, we have the energy vibration of the star. Isn't this one of the most beautiful, beautiful energy reading um, um, lesson you could ever have because all that you need is there your guides an angel on Monday the judgment is showing you the how to make money and how to bring out the blessing and success and with that the world is bringing an end to a situation opening new doors of and your dreams and wishes are coming true now. I am so happy for you guys. It's not finished because as we go to the weekend, we have these two earth energy vibration and the, you're vibrating with a zodiac energy of the earth. And whenever you as earth sign is vibrating with a zodiac energy of the world, we are vibrating with the energy of the aerophant because the aerophant is the energy vibration of your sister sign, the Taurus. And what is happening is that the energy of this, especially for the men, the men, the younger men, if you're studying, yeah, it is the Prince of Pentacles. If you're studying, it's going to be, and this is for people, this message that I'm going to give is for people who are studying. Because this Prince of Pentacles with this elephant is an organization, okay? So whatever, all you people between the ages, again, between the ages of 21, 18, let's say 18, you're in college, university, or what, you are going to um, um, be gratified about your exam. You're going to pass your exam. You are going to get high grades for your exam. This is for the people who are studying, whatever you might be studying, whatever age you might be, you are going to pass your exam. It's no question. It's, um, it's, it's working hard. So listen, I can tell you that you're going to pass, but if you're not working hard to pass your exam, it won't happen. Okay. So you need to put a little bit in there, but for the rest of the people, this is a situation where on Sunday you're going to connect with an organization and this organization is going to bring a cleansing. So whatever organization you decide or whatever group of people you decide to be with on Sunday is going to bring a cleansing to a situation once and for all. This is going to bring a cleansing to a situation once and and for all because your week your week is the most powerful week the Sun energy in the middle of the week is um, spreading the love and light and um, the success a lot of success is going to come up for some Capricorns in this week a lot of success and the energy of money this week is the is, is, is the earth energy uh, uh, zodiac earth energy vibration week and the only water energy you have one water one heat air and the sun so you have all the energies and this air energy is something information something judgment is calling on Monday and this information is going to bring you to such a high energy vibration it's going to Tuesday you're going to start building on something Wednesday, the, the light, the universal light is going to shed on you, bring in another cleansing to you. The sun energy is always success. The sun, and with the sun, the world, and the, the sun, the world, and the star together. It's an amazing, amazing week, people. You need to use the sun. 
the Sun is linked um, linked with the Sun associated with corporation groups work partnership here everything comes together clearly directed positive energy good fortune and contentment are coming the fire of the Sun motivates us and stimulates us our creativity the Sun holds vitality energies strength and the male principle of the sunflower or holy symbol of divination the wings coupled has been united and transformed and the Lotus misfortune corporation creativity talents and project given ideas their um, materialistic form the Sun illuminates the mandala from the series and the Honda and the Arabic sign of Resh is the symbol of the head and represent new ideas this is the most beautiful beautiful and this is why I'm saying and I let people know every card deck has their own different meanings and we need to understand that the world the world link with Saturn associated with the enlightenment and you are ruled by Saturn people so this is a powerful week for you manifest that which you need it is ruled by Saturn individuality prosperity victory willingness and completion for many people the end of a, a major economy means a new beginning much like the spiritual and the spiral that turns to a higher level the Hindu God Shiva is both the creator and the destroyer the cosmic dancer has united the female and the male principle along with all other opposition through this dance movement he balances the cosmic forces for the holistic approach to life his four arms conjunct the four wind four beans four directions and four element the Taurus earth the eagle the hare the lion so this is what I'm reading so you have the Hindu God and that is the Hindu God and what I'm so loving about this card look at all the different um, animals the four different animals we I see the bull I see um, the sea lion and that sort of a thing and that is the Hindu God photo and I love the sign the Hindu sign that is written on top this is why I feel so powerful when I, I read with these cards because the energy vibration it is so it's just everything I can so connect to them I wish I could use them all the time <laughs> As we go, and I told you this video was going to be a longer one, we, we are going to look at the stars. And I'm, I'm actually reading it from the book because I want you to understand what the book is saying. Link with Aquarius associated with the self-confidence and um, recognition. After the storm comes peace and after the darkness comes light. The star card encourages us to have hope, optimism, faith in divine inter intervention and trust in or inner guides it often it offers the the gifts of the permanent the star is the light that guides the way the um, pyramids have an astrological connection to the star series the star series and this is what I've always been telling people that we need to educate ourselves more. We need to understand what is Ceres. Ceres is a, is a planet, a solar system. Ceres is a solar system, not a planet. Sorry, a solar system. And there you can ask them if you can visit them through your sleep time to learn more of the things. And this is only because, listen to me, people, you need to understand that the, the angels and guides and these beams are opening up and coming up but if you will want to go to them for the wrong things to use it in the wrong way it's not going to happen so be aware so the star you know and it's these are all holistic um, um, ways of helping you know it is linked 
with certain aspect it's linked with Pisces and certain aspect and that sort of a thing I know this read it is a little bit longer but I have to give you this because you have the most beautiful beautiful um, um, <laughs> um, decking of cards that I could never ever not give you a proper reading the energy of the tower is going to be your energy vibration and there is going to be a proper cleansing coming in and I want to say namaste until next time. <laughs>